Opihi are considered a Hawaiian delicacy that have gotten harder to find over the years. A program at UH Manoa is hoping to change that. These are opihi. They're limpets that live on rocks in Hawaii's nearshore waters. They're a traditional Hawaiian delicacy, but due to overharvesting, their numbers have dramatically declined. Though there are some healthy populations on neighbor islands, they're extremely rare on Oahu, and it's just as hard to find somewhere that sells them. We try to keep it on hand, but recently it's been a lot harder to get. So right now we have some available, um, but we did it for about a year. Young says there is demand, so she keeps it on the menu. But it isn't cheap. Young tells me that Opihi is not just the most expensive seafood they carry, it's the most expensive food they carry, period, because it's so hard to find. This is a quarter pound, and it'll cost you $20. If people want it, they pay for it. Like, when we have it, it'll usually sell pretty quickly. A study being done at the College of Tropical Agriculture and Human Resources at UH Manoa is hoping to help reestablish the dwindling opihi population. Our main goal is to be able to spawn opihi, grow them in the lab till they're adults or early juveniles, and then hopefully outplant them in the wild. In order to do that, they first collect full-grown wild opihi and put them in a cup. Spawning is the release of gametes, eggs, and sperm, so we'll be able to collect those. Um, kind of mix them together and in a couple of hours get little babies. According to Valdez, their big break came a couple of years ago. Our farthest has come has been a 30-day opihi, about the size of a tip of a pencil. She says they still have a lot of work to do until they can transplant the baby opihi into the wild. But they believe what they're doing is important. Well, they are an endemic species, um, but beyond that, um, they may not have the, the cute factor of a panda, but they are culturally important. And Mirabella says if they disappear, it would disrupt Hawaii's fragile intertidal ecosystem. We're not trying to stop picking. We're not trying to limit anything. We want to keep them around so people can hold on to the traditions that they have and then also just be able to provide tasty snacks. Everyone loves to eat okihi. For more information about the rules for harvesting opihi or to learn more about the opihi spawning program, log on to kh12.com.